The mayor of Zagreb casts his vote in Croatia's snap election. The country has gone to the polls to choose a government for the second time in less than a year. Experts are predicting a close result and the possibility of another coalition lacking a clear mandate to push through the painful cuts and restructuring being urged by European authorities. A Social Democrat-led four-party alliance stands to win around 60 of the 151 seats in the fragmented parliament. Under former Prime Minister Zoran Milanovic, the SDP hopes to wrest control from the short-lived technocratic government. Polls suggest its conservative rival, the Croatian Democratic Union, is only a few seats behind, however. A close result will leave both parties seeking support from the centre-right most party. The next government faces the enormous task of revitalizing one of the EU's weakest economies. Observers say Croatia is dominated by state enterprises and excessive red tape is deterring much-needed private investment.